<laughs> Hello, I'm Tom. And I'm Matt. The internet has tried to cook bacon in many ways. On an iron? On a blowtorch. But they've never tried using one of these. What is that? Because it looks filthy. It's a hair curler. Right. How hard can it be? <laughs> is this there we go. Yeah. This is going to be too long, isn't it? Uh, we'll see. It's starting to sizzle. There we go. Okay, so the hair curler promises... 170 degrees Celsius. Your, your bacon's gone a bit limp, Matt. Oh, it's, it's, it's always... It's actually... Looks like it's oh beginning to cook. That's, that's amazing! <laughs> that's actually cooking! That's incredible! I, I, it's not that incredible, because it's a hot thing next to bacon. But I'm surprised it's cooking so quickly. I mean, that thing takes four minutes to warm up. So and we've only just turned it on. Yeah. Can we attach that bit somehow? Because we're going to have raw bacon otherwise. Right there. Got it. I, I'm probably not going to eat that end bit of bacon. No. I get the feeling that's not going to be cooked through. Should I check the other side? Yeah. It's sizzling nicely. It's not the quickest bacon cooking I've ever seen in my life. Does it stop sizzling? No, it's still doing. Obviously, we would suggest you never try this at home. Yeah. We are fully qualified. Idiots. <laughs> <laughs> I am I am fully qualified. I'm fully qualified as a linguist. <laughs> and I'm fully... This is some kind of engineering, isn't it? <laughs> I think Isambard Kingdom Brunel will probably not, <laughs> not count this under engineering. <laughs> but he didn't have these to play with. He didn't, that's true. It would have looked good if he did, though. Oh. Isambard Kingdom Brunel with a perm. That would be a powerful look. Uh, Do you want to try and un... You hold it and I'll tongue it. Alright. <laughs> Eight hours later. That's surprisingly not very hard. Okay. Is this like a non-extreme version of the uh, clay making thing of that film? Ghost! <laughs> No, it's like a really dodgy crystal maze game. I've dripped fat all over your hob. We've got a fully working hob here, Matt. Why are we doing this? <laughs> Would we be laughing this much? No. Are we using the hob? Grab, 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 grab. It's shrunk. Bacon shrinks when you cook it. it yes, that's true. It's sizzling. Bacon sizzles when you cook it. Yes. It's dripping. Bacon drips when you cook it. Yes. Looks like a duck, quacks like a duck, might be bacon. <laughs> also, might be food poisoning. We should get one small strip here. Yes. That has something cooked on it that we can eat yes. without dying. Yes. That's a crispy bit. That is a burnt crispy bit. Bring the camera in. That is unquestionably a burnt crispy bit. Right, let's put the plate down. Yep. Camera back. Knife and fork. Shall I, shall I... Yeah. Shall I chop it in half? Chop it in half, I'll have a bit of it. There we go. <laughs> I'll, I'll have that, that bit there. There we go. Yeah, camera, yep. camera over here. It took us 20 minutes. <laughs> we have tiny pieces of cooked bacon. The only bits of bacon here we actually trust to be cooked. <laughs> It's cuddled. <laughs> it is cooked though. That yeah. is definitely cooked bacon. Yes. <laughs> We're not going to cook the rest of the pack like that. <laughs> Do you want to get a takeaway, Matt? <laughs> That's a brilliant idea. <laughs>